guys, we're still here at Fort Bridger, but now what I'm having you guys look at is how the rest of the community began developing. So as people moved west, you have to understand that there just was like nothing here. They've got to build everything from scratch. So obviously they're going to start by building a house. And then after they build a house, they're going to try and get their farm together. They're going to try and get their life together. Eventually other settlers are going to move in. So now your nearest neighbor might only be one or two miles away rather than five or 20. And so as that starts happening, they start beginning to build other things that you would have already seen in the east. For example, something as simple as a milk house where you would store your milk becomes a sign of A, civilization and B, wealth. But here's something else that's actually more fascinating. If you take a look with me over here, right here, starting right here, and working its way just to the end right here is the first schoolhouse in Wyoming. Now look at this thing. There's four people that can fit in here. We couldn't even socially distance two people in this place. But you have about four or five students that become the first students in Wyoming in this one room schoolhouse. And eventually they're gonna go on and actually be able to go to Eastern schools because, well, there was at least some sort of an education system here. This one room schoolhouse is going to be the basis for most of the education system in the West for a very long time. In fact, my own grandmother was actually kind of in this same sort of a situation, a small schoolhouse, simply because there's just not enough resources to have anything bigger. So you may have a kindergartner in here and you may have a 12th grader learning at the same time. Imagine how well that's going. Kind of an interesting thing. Well, as you start getting some of these smaller things, come with me and I'm gonna show you. Eventually we start kind of building up the left. And as we do so, we start bringing in stores, we start bringing in uh, places to park wagons, parking lots, it's a sign of civilization, all I can say. And as you can see, we kind of start making compounds and this becomes eventually towns, and you can kind of start seeing how the West was once.